Okay, let's just listen up. We're just going to get warmed up. We're just going to get warmed up, so it's not going to be a big deal. Okay, how it all works. Split yourself into two, two lines, two lines. One on this side, one on this side. Okay, two. Good. Okay, so here's the activity. Someone's going to grab a ball, okay, and it's going to be knocked into this grid here. There's two grids. Everyone follow me? One on this side, one on this side. Okay, you see this where you're standing? That's the center. You got it, bro? Good. Yep. <clears throat> okay, so we're going to walk through it. You're going to knock the ball. The, the grid goes from this line of orange cones to that white line over there. Okay? <clears throat> when you knock the ball in, five players go in. Okay, five players. Five versus five in this grid. Red, you get a point if you can dribble the ball over the line of orange. You got it? Make sense? Okay. You guys get a point if you steal the ball and dribble the line over the white line. Dribble the ball over the white line. Okay? Same thing over here. You're gonna knock the ball in. The grid goes from the white line to the orange cones. You score red by getting the ball under possession, dribbling it over that line. Green, you score by dribbling the ball over that white line. Make sense? Okay? <laughs> and what you guys are gonna do is this. Uh, one, two, three, four, five. One, two, three, four, five. You guys go over there. You'll be a group of five that go in after every service. Okay, so you rotate it. Does that make sense? <laughs> okay, so let's look at one. Ready? Let's look at one. Ready? Yeah, knock the ball in. Just why? Hold it. Hold it. Hold it. Good. And play. Five in. <laughs> You're trying to get the ball over the line, Red. Ready? Same thing. Let's go. Knock the ball in. Try and get the ball over the line. All five go in. <laughs> if it goes out of bounds, you just reset. Good, and we start again. Let's go, start again. Right away, you get a new set of five. Balls out, start again. Right away, red, drop off. Red, red, drop off. Play the ball in. Five, go in. Good. Balls out, grab another ball. Let's go. Uh, go forward if you can. Go forward if you can. Balls out. New ball. Balls out. New ball. And hold. And hold. Okay. Any questions? Okay. Okay, so this is what I want. Before they serve it in, my two players here, I want you to drop all the way to the white line. All four players if you can, except for the guy in the middle. So Paul Scholes, you stay there. Drop all the way to the white line. Same thing, drop all the way to the white line. It's going to give us a little bit more depth. Okay? Ready? Five more minutes. Let's go. Play. Same exact thing. Go. <laughs> okay, so so coaches, just real quick. Um, I'll, intru I'll introduce myself. Sorry, good. Okay, yeah, so hey everyone, thanks for coming out. Um, this, this is uh, Brian. Okay, so Brian is the new technical director for LSA. I, you said, you've seen a little write up. He uh, has uh, tremendous experience, he's been around a lot. Um, so the idea is that he's going to come out here and just show you guys some things you can do more training, right? And I'll, Brian, from there, man, you'll get taken away. <laughs> so Tony asked me to uh, work on building out of the back. So what we're doing, we're just having a, a little warm up activity. I'll be the first one to tell you, you know, when it comes to warm up, just get the kids playing. Get the kids playing. Um, you know, we can argue the, the relative uh, importance of going through all 22 minutes of a warm-up, but I think the more they play, the more they start to get focused. Already, I mean, you know, the concept right now is just, really, we're just trying to get the red team to see how well they can get over the line without any sort of coaching, right? It's 5v5 in a tight space. I don't expect, expect them to be very successful. I honestly don't. But right now, what we want to do is just kind of get the, the attitude that, hey, we've got to try and keep the ball. Okay, we've got to try and keep the ball. So we're going to let them play a little bit, and then we're going to get into the whole aspect of trying to build out of the back. So <laughs> the sessions, whole idea, if you have any questions or whatever, feel free to jump in. But right now, like I said, we're just getting them into the mindset of trying to keep the ball. Okay, and we're going to give them some hints and ideas. And then at the end, we're going to play an activity that I used to do all the time with our uh, U.S. Soccer Development Academy team. I think, I told Tony, I think the boys will enjoy it. Um, it's an activity that we used to do to give you an idea that 
in a quarter of a field, 11 v. 11. We're going to do it in a half a field, okay, but it's going to be a little narrow. You could do it in a big field if you wanted to. It doesn't matter. But I think it'll be valuable in teaching kids how to play out of the back. If you teach them how in training that playing out of the back is going to be hard and in a small space, when they get to a big space, it's going to be the eureka moment, right? It's going to be wow. Most people teach building out of the back in such a big field. You know, this field uh, is 54 yards, half, half length, right? So give or take. It's a little bit, sh a little bit narrow. Yes. But <clears throat> if you teach them in half that space and how to build out of the back, they'll be much more comfortable in a bigger field. Does that make sense? Uh, what age group do we coach? 12, 13s, 14s? 17s. 17s? OK, OK. So we'll, sh <laughs> we'll get into it a little bit. <laughs> Um, I asked Tony for 22 players. Obviously, he likes to go over the top and give me 30 or something like that. Ryan yelled at me for the D course. I didn't have enough. <laughs> so we'll we'll make we'll make it work. We'll make it work. Okay. Um, so let's just watch for a little bit. <laughs> so <coughs> question for the group. I put uh, the field small. It's five versus five. <laughs> but what kind of shape do you see that they're in already? Okay, so we have two backs, right, already, two, two center backs, and we have two wide players, and we have a, a midfielder, a midfielder. So we're going to eventually build off of that. Okay, we're going to build off of that a little bit. <laughs> okay, and time! <laughs> and time! Okay, let's do this. Give us a stretch. Stretch. What? Like, name a stretch. Okay, everybody hold your right leg. Okay, then drop that leg, switch legs. Give us a stretch. Yeah, stretch. Okay, lunges, show us. Let's go do five lunges each leg. <laughs> Okay, what I want is this. <laughs> Can I get the green team? We're going to call you green. Everyone here from green over here. Everyone from green over here. <laughs> Everyone from the red team, do me a favor. Just come up to these cones. Come up to these cones. That red team stay. That red team stay. <laughs> okay, so this is <laughs> what we're going to do. I'm going to demonstrate what we're going to do here, and then we're going to replicate it over here. When we go back, what I want is this. One, two, three, four, five, six, seven, eight. Over there. One, two, three, four, five, six, seven, eight, nine. Not yet, not yet, not yet. When we go back. <laughs> okay. So here's the activity. Do me a favor. We're going to call you a center back. We're going to call you a center back. So go on to the white line for us. We're going to call you a left back. So go to the yellow cone. A right back. And we're going to call you a fifth field. Is that a deal? <laughs> what I need is this. Can I get... One green player over there with the balls. <coughs> and then that ball there, right there, big man, just knock it over here. <coughs> okay, so this is what we're going to do. <coughs> this is what we're going to do. You're going to knock the ball on the ground, okay, into one of our center backs. Can you do that? Good. <coughs> Good. As that happens, <coughs> we want you to expand wide of the cones. That, that's it. When he expands, you get higher. Good. And you get wide. <coughs> Since he's on that side, I want you to come here. <coughs> okay? So here's the shape that we're going to look for. <coughs> okay? So it's going to be similar to this. Okay? So go back. Knock the ball back. <coughs> knock the ball back. <coughs> All the way back. <coughs> Ready? Go ahead. Knock it in. <coughs> Good. Get expand and get higher. Good. And then what I want us to do is this. You're going to play it to your center back. <coughs> Good. Your center back is going to play it into your wide back. And then I want you to come here and get it. <coughs> Good. And then you're going to play it over to the other wide back. 
Okay, we got that? So let's do it again by ourselves. Ready? Go. Boom. Good. And look up. Good. We got that. Okay. Give it back. So we're going to do that for four minutes. Four minutes. Okay. Four minutes. Every time you play the ball in, one person goes in the chase. So don't let them get there. Your goal is to get this player the ball above the yellow cones. Does that make sense? That player right there, you're right back. Okay, so let's see how it looks. Ready? Go. Play it in. Good. Quickly. <laughs> see if we can execute. If you need to skip, pass it. That's it. And turn your hips and hold. Hold. We're trying to get there. Okay, not a bad choice, but can you get it there? Okay? But hey, I like our adjustment. I like our adjustment. Let's try it again. Give me the guys I pointed to go over that side now. Everyone that I pointed to. Let's go. Ready? Good. Knock it in. Yep. Good. And hold, and hold, and hold, and hold, and hold. Our starting positions. Come on back. Get, get the ball. Get the ball. Right here. I'm going to take your spot. So step out. Come on over here, buddy. What's your name? Jackson. Okay, so we're going to stand together. Okay, get played in. As it comes in, then I break off. Good. And then now, and freeze. If he cuts off that lane, where can I pass it? Him, or I can pass it to him. Does that make sense? So get, get close, and then get big. Okay? <laughs> Got it? Green, if you win the ball, you're trying to get over the line. You guys are trying to do what? Get it past the yellow cone. Good, get it past the yellow cone with your right back. Okay, so let's see how it looks. Ready, good? Good, quick, expand. If it's not on, good. This way, quicker, good, open your hips. There you go, I like it, and then reset again. Okay, same thing over here, guys, get set up. So, big man, center back. Who's my other center back? Big man, good. To the six, you're my right back, you're my left back. <laughs> okay? So same thing over here, we'll walk through it. We'll walk through it. <laughs> Ready, play it in. Play it in, we need a, someone to play it in. <laughs> play it in to the center backs. As that, good, and freeze as that happens. Get big, <laughs> get big. Good, get higher. <laughs> good, <laughs> and I want us to be opposite. So you're here, you get higher. So if, if he's there, the free one, you come here, okay? Good. And we're trying to get him the ball over the yellow line. Does that make sense? One, you know, yellow line of cones. You got it? Okay, so it would go into him. Good. If it can, it goes into him. If not, it can come to you right away, depending on where that defender is. Okay, you, you got it? Okay, let's see how it looks. Let's go, four minutes, four minutes. <laughs> Good, now get higher, spring them, spring them, spring them. Okay, I like that, but how about this? In order for us to get a better pass, maybe I have to open my hips. And can you hit it with our left foot? Yes. Okay, okay. Let's go. Start again, start again, let's go. Get played in. Good, and expand. We're trying to find, if we can't, that, it'll, it'll work, good. There we go. And again. So hold it, hold it, hold it, hold it. Start here. Start central. Start central right here. Right here. Right here. Right here. Ready? Let's go. Play. Good. Now go opposite. My six. And hold. Stop, 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 stop. Go opposite. So he's there. Come here. Good. And turn your hips if you can. Okay. In case. So now watch. I play to him. He's going to chase. Good. Now you can play to me. Good. And then we're out. Okay, got it? <coughs> Let's go again. <coughs> Two and a half minutes. Good. If it's that said, use the six. Use the six if we can to get out. Ah. <coughs> okay, so hey, <coughs> can we open our hips a little bit earlier? But when we got the ball, you just look that way. Look that way. Does that make sense? Okay. <coughs> Good. Go forward. That's better. And then find the wide back. The opposite. Quicker. 
Good, look, there you go. Ah, so a little bit earlier, right? Can we clean up that first touch? Make sense? So it's a faster, so it's faster. You ready? Let's go. Good, now drop off, drop off and help him. That's it, play it. That's magic, that's magic. Last minute, last minute. Good, drop off, drop off. Ah, and hold, and hold, and hold, and hold, and hold. That's a dangerous ball, isn't it? Because it's in the air. So breathe out as we play it. Do it again, do it again. Let's go. Ah, uh, okay, so <laughs> gotta make sure he's ready. So maybe add a little bit of a name. And time! Okay, this group here, just come up here. Come up to this line of cones. Come on, everybody, everybody. Come up to this line of cones. Everybody. Good. <laughs> okay, so now what we're gonna do is this. We want this whole line to move back to the far orange. <coughs> Bring the balls with you. Bring the balls with you. <coughs> okay, so red, our objective now is we're gonna try to get the ball over this line of orange cones. Everyone follow me? Okay, as fast as you can. So what I want is this. I need three lines. One, two, three. One in the middle, one on the, where the pink vests are. Three lines, three lines. Come on, three, three. One, two, three. Three lines. Three lines. One here, one there. Good. Okay, so this time you're gonna play a ball in and three players are gonna go. Okay, you're gonna try and win the ball back. Got it? <laughs> Our objective is to do what? Get over the orange line of cones. Get over the orange line of cones. Okay, so knock it as hard as you can. Good, ready? <laughs> Boom, and everybody in, let's go quick. Can we get it and higher and freeze right there? And freeze. Two steps backwards, two steps backwards, two steps backwards. <laughs> right here. <laughs> So we don't always have to go to him. What's another choice? Yeah, so if I'm here and depending on where the space is, maybe I can go to him right away, right? And if he's, do me a favor, buddy, take two steps that way to your left. Yep, yeah, you, no, no, you, yep. I can also go to him, okay? So can we try and get out of this space just a little bit faster versus slowing us down? Okay, let's start again. Let's go play. Good. <laughs> force, play it back. Don't force it. Don't force it. Don't force it. Let's go. Start again. Start again. So when we go back, we're gonna have to have three lines, guys. Everyone follow me? Okay. So it's gonna start getting harder for the red team, isn't it? <laughs> ah. <laughs> Try and win it. That's better, that's better. And again, and again, one more. Good. And hold, stop, okay. Okay, you can't leave us, right? You're just running. We don't do overlapping center back, so drop off and give us depth. Good, four big steps back. This way, back. There you go. And can you get wider? Good, so now I'm gonna take your spot. I have the ball here. Okay, it's a little bit tight, right? So what can I do? As I, yeah, as I play it back, what are you gonna do? Hold the ball, good, okay, follow, and then I move, good, I adjust. And then, okay, hopefully by then we've adjusted our space a little bit, okay? And then if I can get to the ball before he comes to me, who can I play it to? Over the line, okay? Does that make sense? And so, hey, don't leave him by himself. Okay, we got it. <coughs> Green, you're trying to get over the line. Orange is trying to get over. Let's get it set up over here. Let's go. Move the balls down. Five minutes. Five minutes. Let's go. <coughs> Let's play. <coughs> Good, get higher now. Get higher. 
If you, if you can't use it, go back. Good. And a little bit cleaner, but I like that. You save it. Can we go back? Quicker. Good. And split them. Okay. Hey, hey, that's a good idea. Right? We just got to focus on our technique a little bit, though, right? But I like that idea. I like that idea. And again, let's go. Good. If it's not available, good. Drop off and hold. There, yeah, stop. Give him back the ball. Not bad here. My right defender, my right back, you just ran. Do me a favor, go to the yellow cone. In between the two yellow cones. Right there, good. So when you play to me, I can open my hips. And then now, if I, two steps back, I can play right. to you, right? Or if he steps up to him, get step up to him like he did. I can play it to him and turn. And then can you speed and get over the line, right? With a two versus one. Okay, what do you think? You think he went ran too fast? Just say yes. Yeah, okay. Let's go again. <laughs> Good. If it's not on, we go back. Good. Reset our shape. Good. I like that bucket. I like it. Stay with patience, patience, patience. Good. And again, quicker. Good. I like it. And hold. Magic. Magic. Well done, Red. Red, that was excellent. That was excellent. Good job. Good job. They don't like you. They keep defending you, don't they? Okay. Good. Reset it. Good. Almost, almost. I like the idea, though. I like the idea. <coughs> How are we doing over here, boys? Are you okay? Let's get up. Let's go. Next ball. Next ball. Don't for it. Oh, we've got to be a little bit more patient on the ball. Patience on the ball. Patience. Now you ball. Good. Now you drop in and give him help. And hold and hold and hold. Not a bad idea, but once you play to him, instead of running forward, where should you run? Back. Why? Because he needs like more support. Yeah, he needs a little bit of support, right? Just, but I like the thought. I like the thought. Okay, <laughs> we're going to change it. We're going to make it more difficult. The guy with the ball. Come on up here. That line. Yep, come on up here. Yep. This line, come on up here to this cone. <laughs> okay? This line, you're gonna stay where you're at. Okay? Gonna stay where you're at. <laughs> okay, so now it's gonna be a little bit more challenging. Why? Why is it gonna be a little bit more challenging? Right yeah, it's, it's gonna be a little bit faster, right? So we gotta be a little bit more what? Quicker. Quicker. So our support off the ball's gotta be just a little bit faster. Okay? Are we ready? You guys are still running in. Okay, you're still running in. And play it. Let's see how it looks. <coughs> Good. <laughs> and hold and hold and hold. I think there's a way to get out. Give him the ball there. <laughs> okay. If you notice that as you come here and he goes there, where can you go to help us? Good. Just a little bit earlier, though. Yeah, exactly. But see what happened was what? You were kind of hiding behind it. Yeah, so can you do that next time? Okay, let's go back. Let's go back. Let's go. Let's play, guys, over there. Good. Quicker. And hold and hold and hold. What were you thinking about doing? What did you want to do? Okay, or look. Come on back. Come on back. Let me have the ball here. Right here at my feet. <laughs> okay. Not a bad choice to come inside, but I think could you have done this? Step at me. Step at me. Can I fake inside and go around him? <laughs> right? I'm 46. What are you, 26? You, tw you move like you're 26. That's me. What, 26 is old? <laughs> okay, let's go again. I can't even eat, but I can't even eat.
Good, I like it. Come the other way, go the other way. Good, patience, good patience. Ho oh ho! Well done, well done. All because of your movement. You drew that defender away. Good, come this way. Almost, almost. We're going to need that goal look, look. if we can with those. <laughs> so let's, 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 let's chat a little bit. Let's chat a little bit. Uh, that group over there, they're, they're doing what they want to do. So we're keeping them busy. This group over here, we're kind of focused on a little bit. <laughs> so any, any, uh, any thoughts, any initial things? Is the space small? Yeah, it's small, but have they been successful? Yeah, so instead of, we started off, what, five versus five? They weren't very successful, but we were just trying to get the idea of trying to keep the ball, right? And then as we went, we started off with five versus one. I showed them just one pattern on how to get out, but what was great about when we added the defender? What did the two center backs do right away? Made they, think about that. Yeah, and they, they tried it, but then they realized they could do something else on their own. So we kind of get, we let them kind of learn on their own. And then all of a sudden, they're becoming more successful. We didn't want to start with three right away, right? We already gave them five and we got the mentality going on. So we started with one, then we built it to three from long distance. And then I didn't have to give them pass restrictions, did I? They decided that they wanted to try it on their own. Why? Because the very first activity was a small possession. Does that make sense? So we didn't have to tell them too many rules. They kind of already established it in their own mind. <laughs> And then now all of a sudden it's five and versus three. And look how calm, I'll be honest with you. The composure on the ball <laughs> has been very good for some of the boys, you know. Um, and the shape that they're trying to do is still the, you know, I call it the bucket shape, right? Two center backs, two high, wide defenders, and a six. I, I talked to Tony about this. I'm a huge fan of the six always dropping back and helping. That's the way I like my teams to play. I'm not saying you have to. You know, uh, a lot of teams don't believe in that, but that's okay. I'm just kind of giving you a picture that I like because I think when you build, when your two center backs get wide, it's always nice to have what I call a safety valve in the middle. But if you don't believe in that, that's okay. It's not going to hurt my feelings. It's not going to hurt my feelings. <laughs> well, so <laughs> what we're going to do is we're going to put a goal back there, okay? Uh, we'll give the kids some water and um, we're going to play a game that I think you'll get to see bigger. You'll get to see it even a bigger scale. What I'd like though, um, who's the coaches of these teams? Ron. Tony and Ron. Um, keep, I wanna keep this back four and five. So if I can get the, this five, so set them up in a four, three, three in red and the other team is a four, three, three in the green. Okay, two goalkeepers that makes sense um, I'll, I'll sort out the cone so don't worry about that but does anyone have any questions on what we what we're what we were doing or um, thoughts I'd say no I'd say it definitely you got better on the reds than once they started waiting for that first defender to commit yep exactly exactly but they're starting to get more composed, aren't yeah. they? You know, they're starting to get more composed on the ball. The difficulty I always have, and this is a, a philosophical thing, we could do the same thing, five versus three, the entire width of the field, which is 55 yards wide. How, how easy would it have been for them? I mean, if they, if they couldn't, if they weren't successful nine out of ten times, then, uh, you know, whew, that, I don't even know what to say. It, you probably would have started crying as a coach, right? I mean, let's be honest. But now, you know, we made it tighter. So I'm hoping when we go bigger, they'll be a little bit more composed with it, right? We hope that's the plan. That's the plan. We could have went a little bit wider, you know, but the, the hurdle that I have, so these are a combo of 12 and 13. Some of the kids can't drive a ball, right? They struggle to drive a ball over 30 yards. So the problem is that if we go too wide, the center back can't play it wide. You know what I mean? He, he can't play it. So we're gonna be careful. We can't make a field the size of which they can't execute. I, I 
love the compressed fuel. You know, that, that gives them a better, a quick reaction. I, I'll tell you what, I, you know, Tony, we had, a, we had an ODP event in uh, Florida. And I'll be honest, as, as a whole, we're, we're technically we're slow as a state. And I told our coaches at a meeting that we have we have to we should always start training small and get bigger, because part of the problem is no one likes to do technique. We're Americans. Most of us are Americans, and we just don't like the monotony of technique. We don't. But if you make them in a small space, they have to perform, don't they? So you create an environment where technique is, you know, 60, 70 percent of the activity. So I, so I, I agree with you. I agree with you. Now. I'll be the first one to tell you there'll be 90, 99% of the people will disagree with me. But at the same time, people wonder why we don't produce more technical players in this country. You know, so I guess it's a philosophical argument and discussion we can have later. But so no one has any questions. I think it's very simple. The, the difficulty I had is, you know, we have what a village of kids. But if you have your, let's just say, what would you have on your roster? 16 kids. Right, give or take, you have five players that you're working with, right? If you wanted to, you can add a goalkeeper back here, but that's your choice, you know. So you have five, and that leaves you with maybe 10 or 11 kids, and you can just work them through in waves to develop them, and you can rotate players in. Okay, so can we get that set up? So, uh, so the red, <laughs> yeah, uh, let's start it on the half line if we can, okay. um, and, and then. Ron, you Hey, yeah, guys, this, this one over there. I'll, I'll, I'll give the... the red new four, three, three, I think. Yeah. All right. Hey, Red, bring it in. Red, bring it in. Come on in. Come on in, guys. Come on in. If you're not wearing a red penny, come over here. Hey, come in. <laughs> Abner, Mason. Keep the vest on. Keep the vest on. If you're not wearing a penny, come to me. If you're wearing a red penny, go to Coach Cohen. So who's my uh, my back four or five that was over here? Okay, so we're going to be going this way. We need a goalkeeper tone. Yep, we need. Hey, Ron, Ron. So, so let's do this, guys. No, you are playing right man. Let's do this, boys. Let's do this. You can go get water. Go get water. What I need when you come back. Listen, 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 guys. Real quick. Yes, sir. Hey, judge. When when you come back, what I need is this. Okay. I want half the balls where those vests are, right where we started. Half the balls where those vests are. Does that make sense? Do that. Yes, sir. Can you guys do that for me? Yes, sir. Come on, let's go. Okay, I'll grab you. I don't need you. Hey, <laughs> so, coaches, we may have to move a little bit. We'll probably move over to the side there, so we're not in the way. No, I want the yellow. I'm just going to pick up the orange ones. Okay. <laughs> Thank you, guys. We're soccer players. Make a pile for me there, guys. Make a pile and then come on in here, red team. Actually, give me one ball. Give me one ball. <laughs> uh, get them off the field a little bit. <laughs> on the best. <laughs> okay, red team, come on in. Come on in. That's fine. 
Hold that ball. That, I appreciate it, Ron. Thank you. Okay, come on in. The, the two teams had uh, Coach Tony and Ron set up. Come with me up here and let's pay attention, okay? Actually, you know what, Ron? Have one at the balls each for me. They'll be servers. Put, tell them to put on the yellow. Give me, give me two guys with yellow pennies. One on each set of balls. Knock it over there, boss. <laughs> okay, both teams. Come on in. Both teams. Both teams. Let's go. Come on in. Both teams, come on in. Unless uh, Coach Ron's match over there. The guys in the yellow, come on in. Okay, <laughs> so here's the game, here's the game. We're only playing the width of the cone, so it's a little narrow, okay? But I think it'll be fine. I want everybody to take a look at the zones, okay? It goes from the end line, right, to that line of yellow. Everybody sees the line of yellow, okay? And then from there, it's going to go from that line to this line of orange. Everybody sees that? Don't worry about this cone here. <coughs> okay, so here's the game. Here's the game. I'm going to focus on the red team force. Okay, green, you cannot defend inside that line of yellow cones back there. Does that make sense? So as soon as red has the ball, green, I want you to drop off. Does that make sense what I'm telling you? Yeah. Everybody follow me? Okay, same thing red. When green has the ball, you're going to drop off behind that line of orange cones. Everyone follow me? Yes. Okay, yes. So can we, we can't get past this line right here? Uh, no, when they have the ball. You can win the, so when they come out, you can win it, and then you can go in and score. So if you have possession, you can get past that. Correct, line. right. So that's only for defenders. Correct, okay. correct, yep. So defenders don't have a limit where they can be, it's yep. just the attack. Okay. Yeah. Yep, and it's free flow, it's free flow when you have the ball. Does yeah. that include the keeper? They can't come in. Correct. They can't come in and steal the ball from the keeper. Exactly. Okay, listen. When it goes out of bounds, it's going to start with a kick-in, okay, from the server. So the server's in yellow. You are allowed to punk the ball, okay? I'll point to you, and I'll tell you what goal to play it in. Most of the time, green, just so you know, okay, it's not because I don't like you, but most of the time I'm going to have you play it into the red team because I'm going to focus on them for the coaches. Does that make sense? So the green team, do whatever you need to do to score. Red team, we're doing our best to build out of the back. Everyone follow me. Okay. Any questions? Okay, let's get set up. Let me have this ball here. <coughs> so who am I back for? Who's my back four? Good. Who's my uh, center three? Okay, who am I? My three forwards. Get up higher, get up higher. Center my center forward, who's my center forward? Uh, get up higher, my right forward. What? Get up higher. <laughs> Where's your attacking man? I want to tell you. Yep, yep. Hey, buddy, put your vest on properly. <laughs> okay, we're going to let it play for a little while, guys, so we understand. I'll start with the ball. Remember, you can't defend inside that back zone. Play! <laughs> and freeze. So what I want is this. Here's our shape that I want. My two center backs get wide, get wide, get wide. My left back get higher, almost to the second yellow cone. Good. My right back, second yellow cone. That should be your target. If my right back is there, where's my right forward at? Yeah, get higher to the orange line. Six, my defensive center midfielder. I want you to dip in. We're going to use the term dip in here. So come to me. Good. So we're still going to have our shape that we worked on. Okay, our shape that we worked on if we need to. Make sense? As this happens, if he's here, okay, who's my center forward? Okay, you should be up there higher. <coughs> my center forward. Who's the center forward? Who's the center forward? Then get there. You should be in line with the six. Good. <coughs> my two other midfielders, one should be over here, get wider. And one should be here, okay? Get two more steps that way, center forward. Try and be in line with the six. Get wide, okay? So now our shape is this. If we can play it into our defensive center midfielder keeper, that's what we want, okay? He can open up and then come around, come around here. Then we can try and get out, right? They can't defend in the zone. If he's blocking my pass, what can I do? Play to you, right? If he's blocking my pass, what can I do? Play to you. 
Okay? And then we're trying to find alley lanes to get out. Make sense? Okay, let's try it again. Let's try it again. Everybody up? <coughs> let's go, Pike! <coughs> Good. Good. <coughs> Open up, see if we can find an alley lane to get out. Good, keep the ball moving. <coughs> Good. Almost, almost. <coughs> and then can we pass out of it? <coughs> and new ball down there, yellow, start it this way, punt it to this goal. And hold, and hold, and hold, and hold. This is football country, right? Try and punt the ball like you play for LSU. Can you do that? Okay, give it to him again. There you go. You can tell by the noise. Aim for the goalkeeper. That's half better. Let's go, play. <coughs> Good, expand. <coughs> Quicker. Good. Now come and help him. Come and help him if you can. <coughs> if we can't go forward, go backwards. That ball's dead, new ball, let's go, punt it into the keeper. Give it a hard punt. You can grab any ball you want, there's only 2,500, and hold, and hold. This way, punt it this way. Pick that ball up at your feet, good, and punt it this way. Okay, and hold. Same thing I said to him. This is football country, try and punt the ball like you play for LSU. Give it a little bit of mustard, okay? Let's go play. <coughs> And hold, and hold, and hold. See if you can open your hips, right? So open your hips up this way. Get it here. <coughs> As I open my hips up, right? Can, hold it. Green, stand still. <coughs> There's an alley lane right there. Don't run. Look at me. Yeah, okay. And then maybe he can use him to get out, right? Make sense, ready? Let's go. <coughs> Play. <coughs> can we keep the ball and get out of the next zone? <coughs> Good. Can we go to goal? Almost, let's go, put it into this goal as hard as you can. Oh man, and stop, and stop, and stop. Give it back, give it back, give it back. <laughs> okay, if you need to, run it down closer to the yellow cones and punt it. Let's go, play. That's better, Chief. Let's go, play. Quicker, quicker, come and meet the ball and play it. Good. Now here, here, use them, use them, quicker. Open the hips, can we find an outlet? If it's not available, we swing it. And hold, and hold, give it back, give it back, give it back. We just kicked that ball, didn't we? Okay, right? Okay, we, we're better than that, we're better than that. So how about this? <coughs> how about this, watch this, ready? <coughs> what I want you to do is this, I'm gonna introduce you guys to something called the extra pass. Ready? <coughs> Play it into him, okay? So play it back into him, play it into me. Okay, in front, we always play it in front. <clears throat> Ready, I'm gonna play it to you and I'm gonna say extra pass me, which means play it back to me, one touch. Extra pass me. Good, and then as that happens, clear out of the spin, waste. Good, where's my center forward? You should be central now. Right there, in front of the defender. Good, stay there, you're good. Now look, watch, ready? Extra pass me again, hard. Good, and then now, I can fling it in there, there, or play. Right Come in and get ball. Back, back, back. Go back, good. Good. Extra pass him if you need to. Get him, that's it. Good. Okay, that's better. Come the other way, switch directions. Good, ask for it, ask for it. <coughs> Back to him. Stay there, stay there. That was better, buddy. That was better. Good. Can we get out of it now? Can we get out of it now? And hold, and hold, and hold. I like for the composure. Come on back with the ball. Come on back. You okay? Come on back. <coughs> Come on back. Uh, right here. Right here on the shoulder. Two steps that way. And number five. Over here. <coughs> I'm going to be you. I'm going to watch this. Come on. <coughs> Instead of running away, right? What's your name? Parker. Parker. Okay, Parker, watch this. Ready? 
Instead of running away, I want you to stand still. I'm going to pass you the ball to your feet. As that happens, what are you going to do? Yeah, ah. Let's not, let's not tell the whole story yet. Okay? Does that make sense? Yes, sir. So you're going to say, hey, Parker, stay. Parker, let's go. Play. Come on back. And come on back. Come on back. Come on back. So, Parker, what's your favorite dessert? Come on back. I can't hear. A little bit louder. Okay, do you like chocolate? Okay, get behind him. Defender, green, get behind him. So, when I give you chocolate, you're just going to give it out to everybody in the world and you're not going to have any? You're going to protect it? Okay, I'll see if you can protect this ball like chocolate, okay? No, you can't move until I tell you. Ready? Protect it. I tell you what, man, don't go grocery shopping. Come on back, come on back. Can I have a ball? Ball? Okay, you got to step in front of him. He knows what's going to happen, right? Can you be strong? You sure? Let's go. Play. Go the other way. Good. Reset it. Step out. Step out. Can we now? Can we pass out of it? Pass out of it. Come this way. Come this way. I like it. I like that choice. That was good. That would work. That worked. Good good vision. Good vision. <laughs> now can we build out of the back? And green, you can't come in the zone when they have it, right? Good. We gotta protect it better than that. We gotta protect it better than that. <laughs> can't defend inside the zone, green. <laughs> it's okay. <laughs> come, come back with it, Parker. Come back, come back. Good. There you go. Reset it, reset it. Come this way. No, no, no. Come this way. That's it. Magic. Patience, 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 patience. Good. And hold. And hold. Come on back. Come on back. Okay, so one of the things we can do, stay there where you're at. One of the things we can do is we got to find a way to find our forward. So how can we find our forward? There's a couple ways. Ready? I'm going to play it into you and you're gonna clear out of the space. Ready? Yep, play it back to me and clear out. Right, right, play it in, play it back to me. Good, clear out. And then as he clears out, my, full, my wide back get higher. Good, get on the cone. I can play it to him in that channel. And then now my forward, you can get in, right? Come on back. <laughs> So let's see if we can do that. Ready? When you play that way, back, go that way. Okay? Ready? Go ahead. Play it in. And hold, and hold, and hold, and hold. Okay? Let's go. Good. Uh, it's okay. Play! Squeeze the space. Reset it. Good. Reset it. Patience. Patience. Good. Go backwards if we can't go forwards. Go backwards if you can't go forwards, guys. Let's go, new ball, new ball, punt it in. That's better. Let's go, expand, get big, get big, get big, get big, get wider, get wider, get wider. Good. And it's got hold on, it's gotta be faster. It's gotta be faster, right? Fast. Good, get it back, get it back from him, get it back from him, and open your hips. Okay, so hey, look at me, look, play it in, get it back, and go the other way. Good, play it in. Good. Patience, patience. Good, play it back. Now can we find to go forward, can we go vertical? Split him, split him. There you go, good. That's yeah, okay, but it worked out, it worked out, right? <coughs> Good. Can we go backwards and reset? Good. And then can we go forward right away? What, go what? back. Patience, patience. Good. Faster, faster. Good. Ah, and hold, and hold. Give it back, give it back, give it back, give it back. Not a bad idea. It was a little bit tough to pull off. So how can we pull this off? Okay, so what I can do is this. 
As he gets higher, my right back get to that yellow cone. Parker, to me, you start to come into me. As he starts to come in, he's going to draw a defender, right? And then maybe he's free. You see that? Or as Parker starts to come in, you're available, right? And then maybe I can play him. So make sure there's a channel there first. Make sure there's a channel there. Okay? Ready? Let's go. Play. <laughs> Good. Quicker, quicker. We got to be stronger on the pass. That's it. I like that. Well done. That's good vision right there. <laughs> good. Hey, excellent. Just a little bit faster between us. Us three. Can we be uh, just a little bit faster, huh? Yes, sir. Nope. Let's go. Punt it. Punt it. Hard. There you go. That's better. Let's go. Play. <laughs> can we circulate the ball just a little bit faster and then we can find those channels? Ah, uh, play it back. Don't force it. I like it. We'll take it. And we step up and win it, though. Don't be, don't be shy to play. <coughs> Good. All the way back and recycle. Recycle. Drop. Drop a little bit deeper and help them. Ah, it's dangerous. I like the thought, but that's dangerous. Patience, patience now, patience. Good, good vision. Well done, Parker, yes. Almost out of it. If we can't go forward, go back. Recycle it, recycle it. Good, recycle it faster and hold, and hold, and hold. Yeah, 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 give it back, give it back, give it back, give it back, give it back to him, give it back. Where do we go now? Show me. Good, and my way back, get wide. Get wide and help him. There you go, good. To, um, okay, that's fine. Go, go get someone to sub in for you. <laughs> that almost. <laughs> Let's go. Punt it in. Hard. That's it. Good. <laughs> expand. Expand. Get big. Get big. <laughs> so. <laughs> Just real quick, coaches, <laughs> we got a zone, three zones. The green team can't defend when the red team has them on this back zone. Again, we're just trying to help out and, and get them as best as we can to be a little bit more composed, okay? And we're trying to see if they can find channels, okay? So we helped them out a little bit, and they're, it's starting to get there. It's starting to get there. One of the things is <laughs> I would work on is Every time the ball's coming in, they're not opening their hips fast enough. They're not prepared to play a fast ball. They can, so if they can get prepared, it'll be better. But you can see there's some combinations that are happening already, you know. But so we're setting them up for success right now because they can't they can't get the ball stolen. We're gonna add some pressure, and then we'll see. It'll probably go all chaos after that. <laughs> but. <laughs> You can see the whole idea in order to build out of the back, one, it takes, it takes skill, right? Two, it takes composure and calmness on the ball, right? You can't panic. And then the third thing is you got to have channels. And part of the way we're creating channels is by moving the ball sideways faster, right? The center back to the midfielder to the center back. But also we're trying to get, example, we're trying to get Parker to come in a little bit and we move a defender. And that may create a channel in the center part of the field, or we're trying to get one of the midfielders to, to be in a channel so that we can get out. So that's kind of our focus is <laughs> let them be composed a little bit and then look, start looking for channels. Once we, we release the, the rule, it's going to be a little bit more challenging. It's going to be a little bit more challenging for them. <laughs> Good ball. The center midfielder staying flat with the two center backs. Uh, I mean, because of the, the shortness of the field, um, right now he drops. He's dropping in a little bit deeper than I would say normal. But think, I think uh, I would say this: unless you have center backs that are comfortable on the ball, you may need your midfielder to drop deeper. You know, to drop deeper. <laughs> If we could, well, I mean, we can, we could expand the field to make it longer, and then that way I don't think he'll drop as deep. <laughs> so.
sorry? I'm just thinking out loud. What are you thinking? If you're playing a 4 3 3, yep. but <laughs> so, you're not. Well. And now you've lost your midfielder because now he's dropped all the way. Well, no, back on attacker. I want him to step higher. Right. He's a little bit, you know, he's, he's taking the role almost to heart now, which isn't a bad thing. But um, when we attack, you still what it what it really becomes is a three four three. Right. So I mean you know it's six one way half dozen the other right. Um, I would say it's not a bad thing, you know because you still have some semblance of shape. Um, but when when you lose the ball, then you have to think about what getting those wide players back in. Well, they're going to counter against you. Oh yeah, then. yeah. Well, for every positive, there's a negative, yeah. right? So sometimes it's going to work for you. Sometimes it's not. But you couldn't just shift as a back four. You could. You could. You could. <coughs> you could. As I mean, to have them both go out, and you just kind of. You can. You can. So for example, uh, I got this. So Chile, uh, who. In the last what eight nine years have been very successful at dinner this is what they do they send their wide defenders as high as possible and so does manchester city it's a risk right. it's a risk but the risk is if i have more players in your half of the field it's going to be harder for you to get out now does it work all the time probably not you know but um it's a question for you as a coach what do you want to do do you want to go forward or do you want to sit back and be patient I don't know. It's also oh. skilled too. I mean, if you have a fast center back, yeah. You can hold him back. You know, I mean, you know, one of the things. So, for example, <coughs> it's a, it's a great question because so Man City does it, and if you look, they're the they foul the most. So what they do, they I'm say, hey, every time every time we lose the ball, you have yeah. the closest guy has to either win the ball or foul. And then you all get back and. Exactly. So that's one solution. I wouldn't recommend it. <laughs> Not a, no, that's but. <laughs> But play, yeah, but they play they play in a similar vein as what I'm showing you here. But you're right, you don't have to. Depend on the players that you have on your team and. A hundred percent, a hundred percent, a hundred percent. It's all based on your philosophy. So like for right. me, I'd rather either win or lose a game four to three. Because I think it's exciting, you know, one zero, eh, you know. But. So no matter what, you play a four three three. Uh, well, I always start that way, but then we adjust. I use it. I I use it as a starting. So, for example, the best way to describe it is this: when the whistle blows, we start that way. But when we play, we actually most of my teams will convert to a three-four-three. Three, if that makes sense. When we defend, then it almost becomes sometimes I would say like a three-six-one because I always have my two full two of my forwards drop back and help. You know, but that's that's me that's me and that's just knowing the game and knowing how yeah it, I mean. yeah you know and um player personnel right. <clears throat> things of that sort right. and it's it's i guess it's about risk right Mark, and oh, yeah. reward um okay. and so one thing <clears throat> one thing with the small field <clears throat> again you can see already as i go with the field it, it, one, it would be extremely slow. It would be very <laughs> challenging for them to be able to knock balls. Most of the kids at this age, if they can knock an, an accurate ball at pace, you know, over 15, 20 yards, that's good. But that's that's hard to do. That's hard to do, you know. So um, we make the field a little bit narrower so that they're able to switch fields. They're able to switch fields. As we were, the discussion over here was, you know, it's high risk, right, by having our two wide defenders play up higher. It is. It is. I'm not saying that's what you should do, but that's my philosophy. Uh, my philosophy is I'd rather go forward and put numbers in your half and let you figure it out. You can, if you want, only send one, right, or you can send none. You know, that's for you to determine based upon the player personnel that you have. You know, for me, if I had the red, the red team, I would send them forward. Part of it is is the defensive center midfielder. He likes to sit. He likes to sit. So there's no reason for me to have five in the back. Um, I don't know if it's a bad thing or a good thing, but for me, it, it works for him. So, you know, in terms of what we're trying to achieve, you can see his passing ability has already improved in terms of finding those channels. So, 
Anyone have any questions? Any thoughts? <coughs> so again, what I used to do with my, my teams, we had a, I had a U13 uh, academy team. <coughs> we would play this in a quarter of a field. And um, part of it is, is because it, you know, we wanted to improve their technical ability and speed of play. <coughs> and so it would be quite fast, quite fast. Every now and then we would do it in uh, maybe a half a field. We wouldn't necessarily get to a full field. Uh, but the whole concept is to help our back four, or I really should say the center back and our defensive center and midfielder get comfortable playing with each other, you know, and being composed, and then trying to find what I call those channels, right? How can we find those channels with our players? And it's tight, right? I mean, let's if you, if you were to count off, right? So that's 18, and this is seven roughly seven steps so that's 25 yards of space that we get to feel composed and calm the hard part as i said in building besides the speed and technique is finding channels and so this cone from that cone is shy of about maybe 15 steps 15 yards and so if you notice 11 v 11 right subtract the two center backs the the defensive center midfield and the forward right so 22 minus 4, somebody help me out, is that 17? Is that right? 18? So there's basically almost 18 players minus 1, 17 in this middle zone. So it's hard to find the, the channels, isn't it? Yeah. So what do we have to do? Encourage them to play faster and faster, faster, faster. And if they're successful in this, think about what happens when all of a sudden the field gets bigger. Right? The, the space is bigger, which means the channel should be bigger. Does that make sense? So... <laughs> My belief in, in coaching is, you know, if you notice, I stopped it a lot. I was trying to get them to see the channels, and then now I step away, and ho hopefully we see it. Oh, and I think, I don't know, already, well, that's not a bad, not a good example, is it? <laughs> yeah, yeah, but they're starting to, right? They're starting to. They're starting to. So, yeah. <laughs> But see how, look, see how composed, he, that's our left back he is. He couldn't go forward, you know. My only thing there is, it's not a bad choice. One of the things I would do, I wouldn't do it today, but let's just say I did this every other week. Going into the third week, the next step is we got to train our forwards. If you notice, the common, Parker's done a good job of coming back, but the other two forwards, they don't come back, do they? At all. They like to stand there. They're what we call statues in a museum. So if, if they get comfortable with this zone and they're starting to get comfortable here, now we got to introduce how do I forwards come back. So for example, um, I don't know if anyone watches a, example like Barcelona, Manchester City, or even Liverpool. They always have one forward that comes back. And, and he comes back to help for two reasons. One, it creates space for someone to get around him. It creates space behind them. And then, more importantly, which is interesting, I don't know if you remember when Parker came in, not only did this defender follow him, the center followed him too. So it doesn't just create space behind that forward that moved in, it creates space that, next to that forward. Does that make sense what I'm saying? So <laughs> that would be the next step, the next step. But you, I would say this, you don't want to complicate it. So right now, if we were to get into that, it could be very challenging for them and all of a sudden their head explodes, right? So my goal tonight was to try and see if we can be composed from that white line to about this yellow line and start introducing, see that ball right there? Magic, magic. That all happens because our wide back is wide and high. And if you notice my center midfielder, most center midfielders would have went this way. And what did he do? He stopped and stood still and allow that channel to, to become available. <laughs> so now we gotta get bigger, we gotta get bigger and get a little bit higher, get here, get here. Good, almost, I like the idea. Good, turn your hips, it's Parker on. Play it, play it. <laughs> so hey, not a bad idea from our center back. Technically the execution was questionable, but did you notice he was looking for Parker? And it all started because our wide defender came here and what happened? The defenders went with him and then now that channel to Parker was available. <coughs> so <coughs> one of the things is we gotta move the ball faster. Move the ball faster, good, faster. 
Oh, not a bad idea. So, hey, what's your name again? Move. Gavin, can you just move it faster? Remember, if, if it's not on when you look up, do the ex extra pass, though. Play it in, get it back, and swing it. Play it in, get it back, and swing it. Play it in, get it back, and swing it. Yep. <laughs> okay, free play, guys. Free play. <laughs> free play. Let's go, keeper. Point it in. <laughs> Don't worry about the cones. Uh, no, we'll, we'll do throw-ins or keeper ball. Quick. If it's not on, go backwards and recycle it quicker. <laughs> A little quicker, Gavin. This way. Good. Almost, almost. Not bad. Not bad. <laughs> New ball. New ball. Throw it in. Throw it in. Throw it in. And Gavin, Gavin, when we attack, can you cheat a little bit higher, right? So after the ball moves into the yellow zone, can you start, yeah, start to get yourself a little bit higher. So get yourself a little bit higher now. Throw it in, throw it in. You get wide and get bigger, Red. Get bigger. And hold. Give it, back. Give it back to the keeper. Give it back to the keeper. So what can we do, keeper? Be a little bit more composed. Get them into our shape. So get my center back wide. My right back get higher. Okay? Can you get higher? Bring the ball a little bit higher. Good. So that, that's going to push everyone a little bit. Good. Okay. Ready? And then Gavin, come in and play. <laughs> uh, let's see if we can roll it out. Okay. See? But I like it. I like it. <laughs> Two more minutes. Ah. Uh, don't panic. Don't panic for me, buddy. Be more composed. Be more composed if you can. Play it from there. Play it from there. Recycle it, Gavin. And time. Let's do this. Can we get all the balls over here and all the cones? Come on in. There's some balls back there. Make a pile of the cones for me. Let's get the cones and vests. Cones and vests. Can we get those vests over there, guys? Cones and vests, guys. Cones. There's two balls back there. Somebody go grab those. <clears throat> Let's throw the vest down. Throw the vest down. 